Hello ladies and gentlemen, we are back for round one. Uh, we are on the pl or, sorry, on the draw, and this is a great hand. Only thing we're missing is a white source uh, for stasis snare, but uh, our second white source, but other than that I think it's great, so let's keep it. Definition of a sneep. Snap keep. Ooh. So we get to do evolving wilds, uh, crack for planes. and jam a castigator and an Ugin's insight this is going to be fantastic so well let's just jam castigator can't do anything else and hopefully we get in for a little bit of damage uh or opponent has a herald of kozilek and absolutely shuts us down hmm i don't think i think this becomes really dangerous and i th like i would like to save stasis snare for something better but i think like, I don't think I can face down, like, double Benthic Infiltrator here. Um, well, I guess I've got a Dampening Pulse. I was telling myself between the draft and now that I really needed to save Stasis Snare for something better. But... Hmm. Herald of Kozilek, I think, is just so good. Early in the game, like, a turn 3 Herald is pretty tough to beat. Especially if he's got things like Touch of the Voids and he can cast them for 2 mana, so... I'm gonna... I'm just gonna fire off the stasis snare. This could be incorrect, but... Um... I, we'll, we'll see, we'll see. On four, depending on what our opponent plays, I'll figure out if I want to play Dampening Pulse or not. don't need to play Dampening Pulse here, so... Just play the Shadow Glider. We can play Dampening Pulse instead of Ugin's Insight next turn. Nettle Drone, Incubator Drone, okay. That's that's fair. We can we can block that at least. Titan Coils. Titan Coils is a decent draw. Um I mean Titan Titan Coils is the vestige, but I'm just going to um just jam in for two and slam the dampening pulse. So we're only going to take two damage here. Don't think he attacks with the incubator drone. Oh, he does. Interesting. Um, do I trade it off? Like our opponent's probably going to play something that blocks the castigator. So, although we can just tightening coils it. Yeah, I don't think the castigator gets any better than this, especially if we're going to tightening coil something. Like a wave wing elemental. Alright, no more lands would be fantastic. So the Herald might not have been a, as big of a deal, given that he had like no other really big colorless cards. It's tough to say. Alright, we're going to need some blockers here, I think, soon. Like a Ghostly Sentinel would be great. Look at that. Ghostly Sentinel's fantastic here. Hopefully he doesn't have Touch of the Void. Touch of the Void would be pretty bad, but... I mean, if he attacks with a Merc Strider, like, we probably just don't block. But, I mean... Not a lot of people main deck surge, oh, okay, or um, the the plus two in first strike. All right, Ugin's insight, go. Hmm. Probably just bottom, 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 top, I guess, because then we can block. You know, we can block with the Merc Strider. 
Oh, ooh, and a, and a Titan Coils? Hmm. Alright, I like this. I like where we're going with this. So our McKinney Patrol will never attack, but it certainly can just block. Spell Shrivel's kind of losing its value here. Ooh, should I have held up Spell Shrivel? Looks like... Part the Water Veil. Alright. Well, we figured out who took, the part, who took part the Water Veil. Man, it would have been sweet to counter. I mean, I guess worst case we just chump that thing, but... We could just take six. I don't like taking six. If we chump it... Okay, we have Titan Coils on it, though, so if we chump it, chumping it is probably bad. Hmm. First Strike plus Trample. Absolutely stinks. Alright, so I guess we have to chump it. Hmm. Probably just chump it with the Glider. Because the McKinney Patrol blocks everything else fairly well. All right, Skyline Cascade's good. Uh, lock down that. Tightening coils that. Now we get to hold up Spell Shrivel for, hopefully, value. Like, if he's got a Stone Fury, we get value out of it. Wave Wing Elemental is pretty good. One, two, three, four, five, six. Perfect. And now we can block and attack and do all sorts of fancy things. And a core cascader to block on the ground, even better. Would have liked to land there. Um, to make a land next turn lethal. Oh, I should have done that first. I missed the McKinney Patrol trigger. Forgot that guy was an ally. Actually, I forgot that he had rally, but... That was definitely a mini punt. Although I don't think it'll matter here, because if he's got removal, he needs to remove this thing, or else the game is pretty close to over. Shoot. Uh, yep. Can't... Can't spell shrivel that. We can take two, though. So good draws would be another way wing elemental. Something along those lines. Alright, I'll trade there. I will make that trade. Because they're not attacking. Ah, Gideon's Reproach. Good old Gideon's Reproach. So he could have Touch of the Void and go to the face here, or think he can go to the face, uh, but he would be incorrect. Sweet. All right. Got a little lucky there. Opponent kind of went off. Um, let's see here. Dispel kind of comes in for combat tricks, although we didn't really see much. Like or, uh, We really just saw Stone Fury. Um, Rush of Ice is a possibility. Tandem Tactics, maybe? Turns our Castigators into like actual blockers. If we're going to do that, I'm not sure what we cut, so... Deck might be good the way that it is. guess it's pretty tough to beat that 3 4 with Trample if we um, don't have Tandem Tactics. Tandem Tactics over what? I can't think of anything to cut, so... 
Maybe a spell shovel. You probably just run it back. Um, oh, this is a good hand. Can debate if we want to hold up uh, spell shrivel on three or play the glider. Given that we have dampening pulse on four, I probably just hold up like spell shrivel. Uh, just crack it for blue. Uh, I just want to make sure I don't miss my my opportunity to do this. Double glider, nice. I'm playing the bridge there because I want to get pulse on four probably. Don't play herald. Oh, sky spawner's okay. Hmm. If I hold up shrivel, I don't think I need to hold up shrivel. I can just play glider and then play dampening pulse, and he just shuts him down, right? That's tough. I think this is correct. We can hold up Spell Shrivel for his part the Water Veil. Here it's just dampening pulse, and then we can sit and hold um, spell shrivel up after this. <coughs> Land is pretty good here. I mean, it's pretty obvious that I'm holding up spell shrivel if I don't play anything. But we're not under any pressure. So... I'd like one more land so I can play Glider and play Spell Shrivel. Uh, yeah, let's just counter that. Oh no, he can pay four. <coughs> Shoot. That was a mistake. I forgot about paying with the Scions. That was definitely a punt. Land next, next turn would be fantastic. That's kind of bizarre. Why is he only attacking with one? Does he think I have reproach? Like, I'm not going to reproach a 1-3. That's kind of bizarre. Eh. Probably just play Ghostly Sentinel at this point. It blocks everything. And if he's got part the water veil, then I guess we get punished. Cool. Hmm, that actually hurts quite a bit. I have to play this great horn out. And we've got double spell shrivel. Alright, so we're getting punished for trying to be cute. Should be able to recover though. Looks like we we'll probably take two here. Actually three. What is this? Tide caller. Ruh row. Oh man, are we just dead? We're not quite dead, right? Pretty close. Five, six, seven, eight. Actually, we're just dead. Hmm. 
Well, that was a definite punt. Looking back now. Strictly worse line of play, that's for sure. Yeah, I think we're just dead. Four, five, six, seven, eight. Right. Five, six, seven, eight, nine. I mean, he might put it on one of these and not attack with it. I don't think so, though. Yeah, we're just dead. Five, six, seventy-nine. Yep. Shoot. All right. Well, we will not punt next time. Rush of ice is a sorcery, so. Hmm. All right. Let's run it back this time with less punts. Yeah, I forgot about the the scions there. I guess I could have cast it anyway and made him play his scions or sack his scions. All right. Well, this time we're this time we're casting spells roll for sure. Castigator into Shrivel, anything into Cloud Manta seems like it's pretty good. Into Ghostly Sentinel? Oh, yeah. So I will definitely um, spell Shrivel anything here, I think. Doesn't play anything, though. Um, now I just want to run out as much as I can to punish his... Slow draw, I think. No point in holding that stuff up. Like, we're beating down for six here. And... Play the Sentinel. And hope he doesn't have a Stone Fury. I mean, we have two turns to hold up Spell Shrivel, or to, like, protect one of our things with Spell Shrivel, even if he has a Stone Fury here. So. Ooh, and now we get to play McKindy Patrol. To give our Cloud Manta Vigilance. Our opponent is saying, Deck, no! So maybe we get... We don't get punished too much for punting the last round. All right, well, that was kind of unfortunate for our opponent, but I think we're very fortunate um, because of our punt in round two. Oh, that hand. Sick. Well, I'll take it. So, good game one, bad game three, punt game two. In summary, we're on to the second round. So, I guess we'll see you in a few.